guys and welcome back to this save, uh, this is episode 13 and we've had a slight change of plan um, as you can see we are no longer Dundee United manager it's going from the rise of the Tangerines to say rescuing Rangers and the reason for that is I'm a big Rangers fan and I've played one match as Rangers manager because it was straight into a match I mean I, I done it so I just done that match quickly Rangers were 11th in the league when I took over. Uh, we won the match that I played 1-0 um, against Hibs. So I've decided that I need to rescue Rangers. The, this is the second manager that I've had. Uh, they had... Uh, I don't know, let's see if I can remember how to do this. Yeah, club. History managers. So they had Javier Aguirre first, he got sacked, and then Graham Marty took over, and then Alish McLeish came in, he's now been sacked, and now I've come in. So we are in a bad state. So if we look at the team here, um, I was looking at the contracts there, let me see how I can get rid of. We have got Wes following him, still is the, the goalkeeper, in fact I'll do this, do this. We've got Wes following him and Jack Alswick as goalkeepers. We've got Craig Gardner in on loan from West Brom, who looks a decent player, um, so he'll get some game time. We have got Ray Hudson who's up for sale, uh, David Bates, Calm Elder who is on loan from Leicester. Again, was a decent player, so give him some game time. We have Jimmy Hansen, on, who is from Derby. He can play defensive midfield or centre half. And then we have got Max Elmer, who I believe is formerly QPR, and join him. Uh, and then we've got Alex Tansville, who I've actually had on loan in a previous save. Um, a really good defender. He was injured for the first game, uh, so hopefully he'll be back to full fitness soon. We've still got Danny Wilson, Matt Crooks, Martin Kozniewski, who's a left back. Um, so, yeah, there's left back up from up there. We then got Lee Wallace, Tavs still there, Marco Pedranza. Um, He's on a transfer mark list, but I don't know. I don't know. I'll maybe try and see if I can get some money in for him. Jordan Roster is suspended for the next game. Billy King, Billy Mackay, Martin Macorn, Harry Forrester, Nico Cranshaw, Michael Hallen, Josh Windass, Jason Holt, Joe Dudu, and Joe Gardner. So we've not really signed any players. I've done much business. Um, so I've not track checked. So um transfers. So as you can see they paid hundred and eighty thousand for Billy King, three hundred thousand for the Martin Dinger guy and three hundred and well up to half a million pounds for Max Hember. So it seems to be a lot of money wasted there. Um and not a lot coming in. A lot of young players let go as well. So what I'm gonna have to do is we have to try and build up a squad. Um but it's not it's still only the sixteenth of December. So I've got a lot to do here. Um but I think I know I said it was gonna be done D United all the way through, but I just could not back the Rangers job, especially to take the clubs in. So I want to see if I can make them better. Um if I can rescue the situation. So for this match I've kind of brought the same tactics over as working at Dundee, um, but I'm going to try this one today. Um, let's see, so who have we got? Left winger. We're going to bring in Barry McKay. He's a left winger. Um, target man, Joe Gardner. Let's get rid of him as well, eventually. I don't like him. <laughs> Craig Gardner can come in. For Rossinger, Rossiter even. Um, 
back crooks and Jordan Jones. It'll have to be Henson, so um, yeah, he plays a ball in midfielder. Don't you find us? Ball in midfielder. I just go box to box support. Right, so Mackay on the can go on the right. It's Billy King is fit, so he can come in for Joe Dudu. So we'll try going with the wingers. Um, as I say, I don't really have a lot of here. Um, over my play fairly wide. Clear the ball at the flanks with the two B. Kind of go slightly more mixed. It will close down more. It will do get stuck in um, because we're in we're in a relegation fight. Um, so we really need to try and get get something going now. So this is for the party pistol game. We're going to go with Fleas and goals. Elder Wilson Emma. Um, he can change and some bit of that stuff. Emma Travs. And then we're going to go Hansen, Holt, Garner, King, Mackay, and Gardner up front. So, but you can see there's no depth in the squad whatsoever. So, we're kind of struggling. Really struggling for players. So, uh, I think it'll be a, a busy, a busy January transfer window. I've started meeting looking at players and seeing who I can bring in. Um, I've only got 250000 to spend, so I'll not obviously be, be signing that many outstanding players. Um, just send the assistant to do that. So, let's see how this goes. Right. So the second match is Rangers and we we'll see if we can rescue them. Um I was thinking for I've just pre ordered I'm not going to see for here must have green in this. Um, the play gardener. Oh one now Rangers, come on, this is it. Excellent play by Mackay, Joey Gardner, Hansen and then Gardner. Bang. Drilled it in. Part of Fissel sat up is there. So hopefully we can keep this up. So here's Joey Gardner again. Finds Mackay. He loses it. On the, the break, Wilson gets back. Clears it poorly. And away again. King keeps it in play. Wilson wins it back. Flicked on by Joey Gardner. King. Great save by the goalkeeper there. King takes a corner. It's cleared away. Back to King. Joey Gardner with a header. Yeah, so I, I think in up front, we're going to need strengthen up front. I'm not sure if we're going to go with this tactic or Muller tactic, but I just need to strengthen midfield for the whole team, basically. It's not a Ranger stand-up team. Um, as I say, so as I was saying, I've pre-ordered uh, Football Manager 2018. So the first save I'm going to do on that, on the beta, is going to be Rangers. So I'm going to start off with a Ranger save and uh, try and get it from there. Um, and then I might try and do some sort of journeyman or I don't know. Um, I've seen quite a few people do challenge challenges recently. I think maybe that would be quite good. But I'm going to do a Ranger save and see if I can, how far I can take us for the year. But I need to. So Hansen, Gardner, King. It's a penalty. So this could be two two matches, two two wins as Met Rangers manager and Gartner puts up there. I don't know who they're celebrating me there because uh, there's no bet behind that goal. Um, so yeah, but the, the plan for the rest of this save is we'll continue Rangers. Um, I want to try and get us into the the, the top six. Um, so at the moment we've just went ahead of Ross County there. Hamilton are still pretty advanced. Do you know think I'm making subs there because there's not any day really that can 
come on and make that great deal of difference. Um, to be honest, the team's really, really poor. Really, really poor. Um, but I think, I think I can make it work. There's a few good players. I got a few players, and I, I might see if I can get some money in from selling some of them um, that I'm not going to use that don't fit in with what I want to do. Um, but there we go. A nice, a nice, a, 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 it's barely a Glasgow Derby. Um, not the big Glasgow Derby, obviously, but it's a, a Glasgow Derby. We had 20 shots in goal, nine in target, scored two goals. 50 past the seven percent the the possession and that takes us up to seventh place so we're six points off of hibs in sixth place and we are 24 points off of celtic at the top we'll never get catch that aberdeen in fourth place is l roughly where we're looking to get to um but that's it's a good it's been a good start here so we've had two two matches, two wins since we took over um, as Rangers manager, right? Um, so the next match is away to to Dundee United. So will the fans forgive me? Will I get a good reception when I go back, or are we, or do they hate me now? Um, you'll find out when we come back and join us in a. Well, it'll be a couple of minutes for me, but obviously you are just coming straight, straight back. So I'll be right back with you. I'll bring Wilson on later on. Um, I have brought in, so I brought him in. I brought Ray Wallace back at left back, and Josh Windjass has came in for King at left mid, and Joe Dodo has come in at the back. I think he'll give a different maybe a different uh, option to to uh, Joe Gardner. So let's get straight into the match. Still missing Jordan Rossiter when he comes back I think he'll add to the team. So we're going with West Fallen and Goals, Lee Wallace, Ta Tasmanian Devil, Hayden Mayer, Tavernier, Hansen, Holt, Gardner, Windass, Mackay and Dodo. We're going against familiar team of Cammy Bell, Dacoa, Valent, Pagaloro, Cock, Robson, Adam, Chudari, Spittle, Fraser and Fletcher. And they've got Makeda, McFadden, Keskin, Sardago, Telfer, Gallica and Henderson on the bench. So let's see if I've made a mistake leaving Dundee United to come to Rangers or can I get one over my old team here. So typical Scottish weather, it's like pissing down. <laughs> um, so Motherwell have moved up to level points with us so we need to try and obviously get something here just to keep us ahead of them in seventh place and put some pressure on the hubs. Tavaria, Odo, Gardner, Devon, Te Jodo, Do, Hansen, loses it, Fletcher, you know what this guy can do, Fraser, pings it out to Spittle, brilliant defending, get away, get away, brilliant, oh, excellent defending there, good save by for them who are just finding themselves a bit of commitment here with the players, this is good. So Dundee United, three shots, we've had a shot yet. Not a shot yet, guys. Maybe go from control to a more attacking stance. Let's see how that works. So Holt finds Gardner, Windass, Hansen. Joe Dodo! Get in there! That beautiful bastard, yeah. Excellent ball. Hansen, Mackay threads it through between the two Dundee United defenders and Joe Dodo is there to put it away. Off the big man as Maz Jabari straight away from the corner. No one picking him up. Free header. Look at him come flying in there. 
Uf. So we're kind of a draw with a take a draw. I don't know. Can't believe we're the underdogs. Right, I just think Dodo's in a good game. Jeez, I really need to strengthen the midfield. I don't have enough players that can play the way I want to play. Um, I may bring Cranchero on in maybe a few minutes if he can maybe make something different happen. So Cock, Robertson, it's away by Wallace, Fraser, Robertson, oh, Fraser. Dundee United, I've built a good team there at Dundee United, I can be proud of that, but it's really poor again. Nobody closing them down, goalkeeper no chance. Right, let's go for it. We take off Jason Holt, bring on Crankia. Um, I'll take off him and bring on Danny Wilson. No, I'll do it just now. I forgot about Wacorn. Maybe I bring Wacorn on. Don't know why I bring him on through the middle, mind you. Or... Most of these players aren't my Rangers anymore. Um, well, I think Joe Dodo's still there, but Barry Mackay's away, and God, in fact, they've all scored since they've left Rangers, they've all scored, they never scored when they were playing for Rangers, but they've all scored since leaving Rangers, so, it shows you, doesn't it, maybe it's something to do with the tactics, where Rangers played, or the teams have moved to, maybe playing a, a, a better style of football for them, um, I really don't know, but Joey Gardner scored, Barry McKay scored, Wacon scored, the, the ball, eh, Michael Harren scored four goals in signing for St Johnston again, but we just don't seem to be doing it for us. There we go, a 2-1 defeat away to Dundee United, Ugh, quite upset at that. I uh, thought we could have done it. Fired up. That's what I want. See, that's perfect. I wanted to get rid of my assistant manager. Couldn't. Wanted too much money to walk away. Um, so but we had to keep him. So let's have a look, guys. Um, let's see what they're saying here. It's Chris Wallace, Tony Gallagher. Yeah, I really like him. I want to bring him back. If I could bring him to Rangers, I would, but I doubt I can. Right, so let's have a wee look here. So the schedule is these two games and then transfer windows. So I think we'll come back for the Hearts and Celtic game. That's going to be our next two games. So I'll play these three matches. Offline, we'll play Hearts and Celtic. Um, in fact, we'll do a we'll do a triple header the next time. We'll do Hearts, Celtic, and a cup game against Hibs. Right. So, what I'll do is I'll let you get on just now. Uh, thanks very much for tuning in. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this from me, please hit the subscribe button. I do this. I do F1 Manager, and I do. Um, a game called Startup Company, which is a wee business simulator. So if you want to see any of these, please give us a f hit the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up. Please hit comments down below. Uh, you want to talk about anything, you want to talk about football, even anything, just ask me anything. Put a wee comment down there. But um, thanks so much, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Have a good one.